the mark of the beast. What is it? We're going to find out by Bible and only Bible. Let's go. The mark of the beast is a national Sunday law enforcement, and all who oppose this law will be persecuted with fines, loss of property, imprisonment, and death. Let's go to Bible and learn. Revelations chapter 13 verse 17 And that no one may buy or sell except one who has the mark or the name of the beast or the number of his name, meaning you will not be able to buy and sell if you refuse the mark. But we want to refuse the mark, don't we? Then a third angel followed them, saying with a loud voice, If anyone worship the beast and his image, and receive his mark on his forehead or on his hand, he himself shall also drink of the wine of the wrath of God, which is poured out full strength into the cup of his indignation. He shall be tormented with fire and brimstone in the presence of the holy angels. Daniel 7 verse 25 He shall speak pompous words against the Most High, shall persecute the saints of the Most High, and shall intend to change times and law. Then the saints shall be given into his hands for a time and times and half a time. This is no other than the Pope. Galatians chapter 14 verse 7 saying with a loud voice, Fear God and give glory to Him, for the hour of His judgment has come, and worship Him who made the heavens and the earth, the sea and the springs of water. Make notes. You'll need this for future references. Revelation chapter 13 verse 4. So they worship the dragon who gave authority to the beast And they worship the beast, saying, Who is like the beast? Who is able to make war with him? Revelations chapter 13 verse 8 All who dwell on the earth will worship him, whose names have not been written in the book of life of the Lamb, slain from the foundation of the world. Let's turn to Revelations 13, verse 12. And he exercises all the authority of the first beast in his presence and causes the earth and those who dwell in it to worship the first beast, whose deadly wound was healed. Whose deadly wound was healed? It would be the Roman Catholic Church. Their deadly wound was healed. Revelations 13, verse 15. He was granted power to give breath to the image of the beast, that the image of the beast should both speak and cause as many as would not worship the image of the beast to be killed. Yes, killed. Underline killed. Revelations chapter 14 verse 9. Then a third angel followed them, saying with a loud voice, If anyone worships the beast and his image and receives his mark on his forehead or on his hand. Revelation 14 verse 11. And the smoke of their torment ascends forever and ever. And they have no rest day or night who worship the beast and his image. And whoever receives the mark of his name. Take notes. Revelation 14, verse 12. Here is the patience of the saints. Here are those who keep the commandments of God and the faith of Jesus. It doesn't just say keep the nine commandments, but all commandments they keep. If you do not take the mark of the beast, you will not be able to buy or sell. You may have fines, imprisonment, loss of property, and death. This is what will happen to you if you 
do not take the mark. And praise ye the God if you do not take that mark. We do not want to take that mark. 